What's going on, guys? Welcome back to Online TCG. I am here with Logan. And, uh, <coughs> oh shit! He's fuck. dying apparently. But, uh, oh, shit. Restart! Restart! No, we're not restarting. We're going on no. the fly. We're making it no. work. We're here for the second month of deck build versus the format. So if you haven't seen what this month's build is, it's two hundred dollars. It's prank kids. Go check out the video. It is up on the channel. But uh, it's time to do some ranked and see how it goes versus the format. I like how you got Josh in for salad because he was a pro salad player, and for this he brought me in. Well. I am the best prank kids player at our locals, so didn't really exactly. have a choice on that one. I am just your average combo player. You are average combo player, but this time at least we're a lot further along in terms of rank, so... True. It, it might, might actually be, be meta. Yeah, it might actually be meta, not just versus one player who doesn't know how to play the meta deck. Hey, isn't that every dino player? Uh, well, yeah, I guess. <laughs> what if I just link summon? with your card that's face up on the field saying if I link summon I lose the game. What? What? I, I didn't I didn't watch it, nothing uh, like that uh, we were on the uh we made the prank the not prank it we made the salad card that was like Oh you know, so the Phoenix yeah I did see this. And he makes Nightmare Phoenix and it was retarded. Yeah. I hope he's one of your watches. Uh, we'll find out. Won't and then he unsubbed. <laughs> he was like, oh man, that was embarrassing. Unsub. <laughs> that's yeah. The question is, how long will ranked take? Because ranked on this can take a long time sometimes. I will set it out. Here we go, hey! We have a game as I just knocked over a bunch of stuff. And as always, we will throw paper. Paper gang. You wanna, you wanna explain what happened to locals last night with paper? Oh, we got into a 40 minute draw where both of us refused to not throw paper. It was, it was a good game. The people at locals who were waiting on us were very unimpressed. Yes. I'm almost certain our opponent is not going to be here. Nope, oh, nope, we're proceeding through phases. Oh, it's me. Okay. Okay, so starting us off here, we have relatively full combo. We have the instant fusion, so we have the extension. Um, let's open up with the Lampsies. Let's go Link 1. We will activate the effect. For this, we'll go... We have the instant fusion, so the instant fusion could get us to... Doesn't that get either the weather It gets guy? us to totally awesome, the instant fusion. Yeah. Okay. So we'll need to do a little bit of cycling here. I feel like at this point, he's like, what do you hand trap you? I feel like he doesn't have a hand trap if he lets you go for your first part. Almost certainly. Because you, you always like hand trap the first effect. Okay, so now we want to go back in instant fusion, bring back these two. No, we'll instant fusion after this. So we'll go Link these two off for a bow wow bark. The Fiends' effect. Sending. I could send a Dropsies now and get access to double Dropsies, or I can send Pranks and get access to that later. Actually, since we've got the plan in hand, I'll send a plan now. Just to be safe. Make sure we've got both of those in play. Um, you have Fusion already and Pranks in hand. I think it's fine. Yeah, we have like the whole thing. Rocket ride. Da ship. Summon da ship. Activate the effect so he can attack directly. Opponent appears to now finally want to use a response. Clearly not. I mean, we could have Nibiru. He's going to have to activate it soon. Um... He, he's not going to play around totally awesome. Man, man's not thinking that. Damn, it's the fusion kind of good though. Yeah, it's very good. Very good garden pranks. 
Bring it back to three. Now we've done full combo, we'll slap down our desires. Into desires the into desires. Heck yeah. We got rid of double fansies, which isn't nice, but it's fine. Um, I feel like at this point you're in a stronger position. You set plan here still, right? Yeah, one hundred percent. We can do both yeah. the fusion yeah. and the link full. Yeah. Dang, that kind of buff. We saw the link one there. Away we go. So much card advantage. Have, was the opponent even there? I'm gonna say yes. Are they going through their phases? Hmm. Not sure. Stuff. That's pretty good. Yes, that is that is pretty good, isn't it? Do you negate it with Toad? Yeah, one hundred percent. Yeah, because then you also just take the Duster, right? Yes. <laughs> and then you're like, okay. Damn, not playing around Mech Knights though. Oh no, I didn't play around Mech Knights. We got him, boys. We've got him. I think we ended on that toad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Show me what you've got, fella. Numerons, okay. Um, yeah, like that's fine. I need to be able to negate that Numeron wall, so I need to be able to negate the field spell. Well, to be fair, I just Regeki him once he summons. Yes, Regeki the, the monsters. Yeah. It may stack to one summon. And then you can just bail or link for the summon. Can't always chain here. Surely he's not just summoning one here. You surely get a four. Yeah, he's got four. Cool. Do you just forget him now, so then you can play around Memories of Hope? Yeah. I think that's the card scored, Memories of Hope, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm low on targets in deck. I mean, this is fine, right? Because, like, he has one summon, he can set up on your back row, but you took his duster. So, in theory, you just win next turn. Let's see what he's got. Preferably, I'd like to use this Bower Bark here and get the pranks back so I can start shuffling next turn. Sphere mode. Okay, that locks me out of that. That kind of sucks. Um, Battle Butler effect. So I still have a Roxy's in deck. Uh, this is still okay. This is still okay. I'm going to go a bit minus here, but it'll be alright. We've had a, had a joiner to the video, Sebastian's turn up. Sebastian has joined us. I'm gonna stop. Welcome to a $200 deck build, my guy. Damn. I like that he's fear murdered though, but like, yeah. that does nothing. <laughs> it does nothing. <laughs> okay, so he's playing Numerons, so odds on... Do you, you side in the Twisters, right? Because Numeron, with fear murdered in the main, he's definitely going second. Yeah, now let's side that into 
pop it. I can the deck immediately one also shuts him down pretty hard. The V lot. Yeah. What is he gonna make? He can well it depends what he's playing. He he's playing to attack. Yeah, if he's playing he's, going second, then take apart the Dio Fusion. If you go if you only take you can honestly always also compulse. But I already have the, so much. Oh the Veilers I guess don't really stop anything. The bells don't Veilers, do anything. Veilers and bells don't do anything, especially if he's playing like Neos Fusion or Red Eyes Fusion. Yeah, we'll gamble on the go first then. Like the Red Eyes Fusion still gets fucked by like you can't compulse it, but Neos Fusion stops it. Damn. Yeah. All Damn, those so sides. Cool. <laughs> so, I mean, this gets his a toad again, right? This gets his same board. Uh... Hang on, why did he not sphere mode to start with? Uh, I don't know. Just sphere mode the toad and then. Oh, you only had two monsters, that's why. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, I, I, it was until I linked. Until I, I feel it. like you still activate the spell first, then. You activate Gumor and then you dust off. Because he has to negate it. Anyway. What do I know? Like, do I go for Roxy's here and get the draw? I think yeah, the Roxy's could be the best play here. Dropsies, but we'll have to get rid of it here. Ah, oh, fuck's sake, of course. Fuck. Always the way. Realistically here, I don't know how much the plan does. Plan just means you go next, you get like resources after turn one, which if he's playing Numeron, I think so because he's, if he doesn't win turn one, you're in a strong position, right? Like, yeah. you just play anyway. So I think you go for the Franks. Extenders in hand, so we can just keep playing here, I guess. Let's see if he has the Nibiru. Well, he'd have the Nibiru now if he was gonna have it. Okay, so we burned everything about the dropsies here. Go one more, commit the extra resource, makes the pranks a bit more live. Make the propsies. Get us the lamp. To be fair, in the end, I had access to everything here. Um, so the put back. You gotta just remember, like, he's probably around Sphere Mode here still. Get back one and two into the hand. We'll have full coverage on this board. Is a Ghost Bell? No. Slap Bro, look at the card advantage of, of Prank Kids. Prank Kids is very Prime much card advantage. See if he's opened the, d the duster again. Oh god, I pressed the wrong button. Whoops. <laughs> I was meant to wait for the M phase for that. Oh well. Roxy's goes to grave. We get ourselves a token. We can play with the token next turn anyway. Let's go. 
in phase and we will use the effect of the pranks okay let's put back you you and you please actually we'll keep one of these in grave confirm and of course we draw desires <laughs> If you activate Duster, we can link and fuse. Hey, Trunade, okay. Bruh, hey, Trunade! <laughs> I love that card! Oh, we didn't need to use the... Because hey, Trunade just flips sets, so if we just flip the plane face up, we could have kept it. Um, is do I put another monster on board I don't think I do I don't think so because that plays into a sphere mode I'll just chain block this and off this dude it'll do I'm gonna go and get another place so I can search a monster next turn What have you got here, fella? Has he left? Yeah, he's not playing this anymore. Here we go. Go and get place. We've got four cards in hand, and he's facing... Five cards in hand. Five cards in hand, and he's facing two regular keys. What does Numeron do here? He has to have a card view, right? Like, that's the only he way he's... He has to have a card view, yeah. Sorry, an imperm. Good thing you revealed that sphere mode, game one. Not necessarily. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he really didn't need to do that at all. Remember that, kids. Don't reveal cards in your hand if you do not need to. Thanks, Uncle Ben. Nope, he had a straight kaiju. I mean, that's pretty good. The straight kaiju means we get this back, and then odds on he's going to OTK us now. Too bad, he has Hatrian Aid plus kaiju plus Numeron Claw. That's pretty good. I'm assuming he will, because he's playing Numeron, like, surely. He's got the Duster. Okay. Oh, that's a, that's a we good do hand. have a fat stacked graveyard here with a prank kids plan. So if you if he yeah okay he's got you. He might that's not. Game. No, that's not game. Oh gosh, that's not game. Because we have prank kids plan. But also you have the monster on the field. Because it's game through card you, but it's not game through card you in a, in a defense monster. I think he's I think he's goofed it. Let's see how he does his attack all this year. Because only one of them's going through. He has to attack over the defense with the first. Do we force him? Do I do it now? 
I'll just plan you here. What have I got? I'm gonna reduce his attack by a hundred for every monster in my graveyard. That'd be two attacks he commit, has to commit over a defense position instead of two attacks over an attack position. Yeah, no, that, yeah, you do it now. Yep. Reset the game state. So it puts it back and drops by the number you put back. Is that how it works? Yeah, so I put back a whole bunch of stuff. Leave them, yum yum. Funny thing is, if he doesn't dust me, I don't have this. Now one will attack over for 15, and then the other will attack over for like, a lot. So the other one goes to 8k, so the other one does 58. So that puts you to... We're fine. As 68, long as he doesn't 70. have like, yeah. good back row, we're sweet. That's huge. That's playing, coming in clutch. What does he make? He, I'm assuming he makes an Appaloosa here. Oh, he has a droplet. Oh, That's he has a droplet. That game. Yeah. Yeah. That hand was insane from him. That, that hand was not. certainly a lot of cardboard. No, no deck plays around that hand. That hand's insane. I could, we could have beaten that hand. Wait, what? How? I, if I didn't activate the plan's effect on the Hey Trunade. I could have gone to the Link Four and the Regeki. Oh, true. You came to Hey Trunade. Sorry, Sorry. yeah, network. you're right. Sorry. He does have the droplet though, so it's like. It all comes down to like tributes cost and shit. Yeah. Man had six cards that beat us. Okay, hopefully we can guess... draw that there can be only one this time. Yeah. We still go first. We go first every day. What does Chalice do again? Oh, too late. Uh, it's just target negation. It's almost worth it, right? Because then you target one of them and then well, you negate the To be fair, I could have targeted one of my own and then it stops it from being able to destroy my card battle, I think. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what is We've seen here. the Duster. We've seen a twin. And a Core Buyer. I wonder if he's playing any interactive hand traps at all. I doubt it. I think he's just playing a bunch of power spells and card use. We need to remember to keep a card in hand for the discard. Um, Fancy is what I have an access here. No. We can go the bog standard way. So on this hand, I have full access to everything. So we activate Pot of Desires now. Oh, we got there can be only one. Okay, that's something at least. That's good. That's really good. That's very good. Um, Can you get the toad here? Uh, no. That's a shame. We just have to hope he doesn't have mass back row removal here. If he draws Duster for the third game in a row, we could be fucked. We just throw everything at this. Okay. 
Okay, hopefully he doesn't have it all three games. One day of peace. Okay. So Bro, what is a choice? Sure. That's so. What? Maybe you thought we were gonna make him go first. I thought you were high on the rank, my guy. He's a silver rank. That's sad. We've drawn the parallel X seed. Tell me he just passes. I've just realized we're not playing like my regular build, so we don't have the ability to go like Dragoon Toad in the next turn. <laughs> I yeah, think he's you passing. Just wanna, you just want to get to Toad. Or do you just pass here? Me? Maybe. No, we get to Toad here. As long as we still have a drop season deck, which we do, we get to Toad here. Yeah, you get to Toad. You, you just want to get to Toad. Get Toad so you can stop the Hatred and add Duster, and then you can hold the Twin Twister and stop the Numeron. Do I dare drop Tail Alexeids just to have big 2k defense bodies? I think I do. Certainly an option. I know we'll, we'll hold them for the OTK. Um, no, we're good. Send him to the you, Do you need a parallel XC? I think you hold it. Yeah, we don't. We don't. The last. No, yeah, the last target in the deck, I guess, is the Dropsies. So that'll be that. Small point of concern. We do not have access to a fanzies with this board. Do you need the fanzies? Yes, that has turned off our negation. We need to re-establish that. Um, do you need it? Surely playing... You have the fusion and then Toad and Twin Twister. Oh, these can summon from the hand, can't they? Yeah, they summon from the hand. Um, no, I, I don't have access to it here. There, there is no access. To Toad? No, uh, there is no access to the fanzies to Regeki's board next turn. But it doesn't matter if you can protect the Twin Twist that you can't get any monsters on the board. Valid, but we can do both. So the Toad's more optimal if you have to choose one. Do you have Toad in this build? Yes. So I think if we go... So if we go into Doo Doodle Doo off these two, then we can go effect to summon Lampsies from the deck. Then we can link the Lampsies. No, that would burn the one that we've just accessed. We have a Roxy's in deck, don't we? And Roxy's would net us another draw. This is fine. Let's just play it out. We'll see how this goes. Um, so link these two off. Trigger the effect one. Trigger the effect two. Uh, no follow-up. Go and get pranks for recycling. We'll go on special from deck the Roxies. Now we can go and link them for this. Activate the Roxies effect. Banish the Roxies, draw a card. We, of course, we draw a Pranks. Then we can special summon this Dropsies from hand. And that will allow us to make a totally awesome idea. And then next turn, we can bow our bark. Ban your machine, my guy. Um, something we can look at as well, if he does break the board, if we activate Pandemonium and go into Weather Washer, what it summons can't be destroyed by battle. So we can just battle Butler and protect. Oh, we can Weather Washer protect. And that, st that stuns him for a turn, and then we should be able to kill him with the hand we've got.
You should play a dupe frog in this deck to get two <laughs> negates. <laughs> Gotta be budget, Seb. Otherwise, we just play Verte Dragoon. <laughs> well, that was the one interaction we didn't want to see. We back. didn't think about a lot. Fra, no. what? How many options is he playing? <laughs> That's fine. We have the dropsy still. I mean, is all his monsters just like three golem, three bloody sphere mode, and then three of a kaiju? He wants the versatility. He's activated lightning and storm. storm. Holy shit! Uh, so we just chain pandemonium here. Some of washer. Bro, this guy's capped. How do you make the Regeki here? Oh, we don't make the Regeki here. He just Ooh. can't kill us. Fair enough. Plus he he's got that Rageki. He has to literally have a Rageki or a Dark Hole in hand. Or just a Sphere Mode to Sphere Mode all three prank kids. Or a uh, um, Kaiju Slumber, because he's playing Kaijus. Well, does, does the Lava Golem count as his one summon? I think it takes your normal summon. Okay. It says, set the turn you summon this card. I don't think he knows they can't be destroyed. <laughs> yeah, he definitely doesn't know. He's setting a card though. That's interesting. Evenly. <laughs> Ideally, we plan, reset everything. He's definitely going to attack our fancies first. Oh no, fancies 2k. You can attack that, because that's not yeah. going to die. <laughs> Good work. Good work. Did the Lord's mm. work there, fella? Now he's gonna read it. Now, yeah, now he's gonna read Washer and be like, Oh, I'm <laughs> fucked. And also you've gained 3k. Yeah. Take so it's like, I don't huge. think he's can kill you anymore. He's go he though. goes after the other one that can't be destroyed. <laughs> Huge. I think he's just this boosting man, himself to do damage. Monkey. Sure, but why not do that over the one that can be destroyed? I mean, he still can. That's what I say. Yeah, Mishumi's gonna jump to four now. Use one that can attack over fanzies. That'll kill the fanzies. And then go, and go 8k over, over three. And then I just reduce the 8k one as much as I can. Yeah. Reset my game state. I can link these two off next turn. Start playing again. Pop the back row. Then we just try and get to Boral Sword, I guess. We Why hasn't it been asking for you to do plan? It has. I've just been rejecting it, I think. Ah, uh, okay. Select them all, except the meow meow. To be fair, we put back a Meow Meow as well. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess so. You're playing two? Uh, three. Oh, okay. But like, we're gonna make another one next turn. So yeah. we don't wanna, we wanna always have something left. Oh no, 900 damage. 
this is all going to come down to whatever that macro is. Probably. Did he have droplets last time? No, I don't know. So what does he do here? Like Mega Clops? Pass? Mount oh. Lusa? Yeah. Yeah. But sure. it's fine, I have Mr. Chain Block in your hand. Yeah, that's fine. And we got the instant fusion. Oh, nice. <laughs> Extenders. Yeah, this, is, this, this is good. Okay, uh, so let's open up with a Link 1. It doesn't destroy. It doesn't destroy, yeah. Yeah, so you can have it for next time. Yeah, you can only use each of the ones. Damn. I was like, you can only use? Fuck. <laughs> okay, let's go. How do I want to chain block this one? You go doodle do one so you can have the fusion. I don't even. Uh, I've got the instant fusion, so I just want to be summoning from deck as much as I can. Okay, yeah. Whatever Seb said, I said the opposite of that. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, now you can just beat over it, lol. If you I want to. I know what the back row is. I feel like the back row can't be that much if he plans to get a second. Logan, did he play droplets last game? Yeah. Yeah, yeah so it might be one of those. Pretty strong hand again if he has a droplet. <laughs> I don't think I had the totally awesome right now. True. Shouldn't play this in this column. That was a mistake. Barrage. Impam. Activate barrage. Uh, no, I used it here. I used the thing. <laughs> I used my zodiac barrage here. Call judge. That's so AIDS, and I bet he got away with it as well. Yeah, almost certainly. Like, cause he also kept the card in that column like afterwards, so the judge comes in like fresh. Is like. Piece. Cross souls, what the shit? Uh, he's gonna what, use. What does that do? Uh, well, you see, that's going to summon a. He's gonna tribute summon for. Oh, to summon the god! <laughs> so if I use Ripper on Rooster's effect now, tributing his cost, it will dodge that because he won't be able to. Summon an Egyptian god. And then I believe this boy just summons any two non fusions. So I can now just summon back the Ripper and Rooster. Yeah, that makes sense.
Yeah, he's gonna be... But he's gonna be able to do it again next turn here for months. Well, I can duster him. So, I can yeah. duster him my activation. Yeah. I'll mm -hmm. do it. Apparently, I can't summon the lethal. It, mu it must be Link summoned. Okay, yeah, no, it has the ability to play around that. Cool. Uh, they thought it through. That sucks. Um, how am I going to do this one? I need the. So we go for Doo Doodle. And dropsies. I'm going to have to do something here. Something is this. Activate that. Get back this. And what else? Fuck. <sighs> this ain't good, fellas. This ain't good. Oh, I have a normal summon. I haven't normal summoned yet. This is fine. This is this excellent. This is fine, my guy. <laughs> You've done it. Okay, cool, 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 cool. This is fine. Um, so now I will proceed to the end phase. To what do you send pranks? Activate the pranks. Put back the rooster. Put back the doo 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 and put back the rocket ride. Confirm. Need your desires, that's not good, because that's dead. Yeah, it is pretty dead. <laughs> it's entirely dead, because your next turn you have 11 cards. <laughs> the only issue I have is he's going to have priority. And if he just declares network, I think we lose. Yeah. He has to do something else first. Could you not have just planned in standby? Uh, it's main phase only. Ugh. So you have to pass priority to be able to use it. Monkey brain. Monkey brain. He just needs to activate anything else. He's really thinking about it. Oh. He's going to just activate another fucking kaiju. Of course that's, he is. And that's game as well. That's, that's game over. Um, unless... <laughs> Is it? We're gonna have to get really fucking cute with this. <laughs> no. You're gonna build a wall? Yep. Oh god. Actually. Nah, it's still game. Is it? Yeah, he can summon four guys. One of them attacks into the defense position monster, making them 2k. One of them attacks again to the defense position monster, makes it 4k. 4k attack over Golem for 1,000. So you're on 61. Yep. They're 8k. They attack over the Link, that's 7k. Uh. And so you're dead. But he might not see that line of play because he might be a monkey. Let's find out. Given that we've got the Meow Meow in attack position anyway, we're pretty fucked. Yeah. Well, you can't really put in defense position, so... This is so shit. We're going to 
going to lose to I tribute your monster I summon four times I win haha <laughs> I remember when this was going to be like the most OP deck ever and then it didn't do nothing this isn't the reason why no bring back Vexel <laughs> We had that one locals where everyone was like main decking ghost ogres. <laughs> yeah. It would be. F oh, actually, your dead is away. <laughs> he might do something funny here. Mm -hmm. He could just attack into all your defense position monsters, attack into the Meow Meow, deal 7k, you survive on 100, pass the lava golem, kill you. Yeah, that's always an option. That's pretty funny. I I'd do that line of play. <laughs> So annoying. This is like the most painful part because we're just literally hoping that he misplays. Yep. Realistically, he can't misplay. You didn't need <laughs> to use the droplet. He's flexing on the droplets. <laughs> what a what a guy. He's like, man, I better use this droplets. My maths is off. No, it's not fucking off. You just attack over Lava Golem, do a thousand damage, then you attack over the Meow Meow and do 7k. Oh, well, at least he didn't open dust at that game. This is a sad way to go out, Ben. Yep. That was real shit. Bring back Josh Glenn. <laughs> <laughs> 